Starting for students across Metro Detroit. Some kids heading back today, others tomorrow, and some getting one more week of summer vacation. Since our 7 Action News school supply surprise aired last week, many people have been reaching out to us. Some asking how to get help with school supplies, others asking how they can help those in need. 7 Action reporter Kim Russell is live with the answers to both of those questions. Kim? You know what? What's really clear from the emails I got after people saw the 7 Action News back to school supply surprise and people reacting with joy at news that someone wanted to do a random act of kindness is that we have awesome people in our community who simply want to help others, especially kids, excited about school. As parents prepare, they are finding the cost of back to school is increasing. For some, the money is simply not there to buy needed supplies. I want to make sure we can help as many kids as possible not having to go through the same experience of having the same old backpack, the same ripped backpack every year. Hussein Hashim, who owns Educare Student Services, a tutoring business in Dearborn, also remembers what it's like to not have all the supplies needed. He says in his work tutoring children, he sees the need every day. With the help from donors, he is hoping to give 1,000 students in Dearborn, Dearborn Heights and Detroit supplies. One of several events is at Med Wright Pharmacy in Dearborn Heights on September 7th, starting at noon. He says helping with something like this is an act of patriotism. Any successful and prosperous nation is based on education. So those are just two events that we learned about after we did our school supply surprise and people said, hey, I'm helping people and we want to know if anyone needs help. We're going to have all the information on how you can help them or get help at our website, WXYZ.com. And we'll also list other events that are working to help the community. Reporting live in Detroit, Kim Russell, 7 Action News.